Logan. Hi Logan. We hear you've had some very exciting news. A little baby brother. And we know you're going to look after him for us. Because you are going to be the best big brother ever. And we're very excited by all the news. We're going to read a couple more books for you now, Logan. We hope you enjoy them. See you soon. See you soon. Hi, Logan. I'm going to read you a new story today. And it's called Logan the Monster Truck. I really hope you enjoy it. Logan the Monster Truck. Just going to get into the story. Wow, did you catch that big jump, Dad? Logan said as they watched the big monster trucks in the large stadium. He must have jumped at least 10 cars. Yes, I saw that, said Dad. But I like when they spin around making donuts. Logan smiled and roared his engine with approval. Brum! I want to grow up to be a monster truck. You can be anything you want to be, Logan, Dad said. Just remember that to be good at anything, you need to work hard. And here's Logan and here's Dad. The next day, Logan woke up early. Why are you up so early, Logan? Dad asked. You said I need to work hard to be a monster truck, Logan said. So that's what I'm going to do. Mm -hmm. Then I will help, said Dad. Together they built a small and simple race course in the backyard. It had a small jump and some big tyres in the roadway as obstacles. Start slow, Dad said, as Logan got ready to start. You need to get used to the turns and the jump. If you go too fast, you will crash. Got it, Dad, Logan said as he revved up his engine. But in his excitement, to run the course, Logan went too fast and flipped over. You okay, Logan? Dad said as he rushed over to help. Ow, Logan said. He had a bruised front bumper. I should have listened to you. Try again, said Dad, but go really slow over the whole course so you can get used to everything. Then you can go fast when you're ready. Logan nodded and headed for the starting line again. This time he took the first lap slow. Noticing how tight the turns were, he studied how to go round the obstacles and then he looked at how to line up for the jump. The next lap went a bit faster and by the end of the week Logan was zooming around the track. You can see Logan zooming around the track with Dad watching. You're doing great, Dad said. Now let's change the course. They built a higher ramp, dug a pit and filled it with water, added some old cars to jump and added tyres to the obstacles. This time, Logan slowly moved around the track, looking at how best to drive through it. Then he went a bit faster. The new course was more difficult. The turns were tighter, and he sometimes got stuck in the mud pit. As you can see, here's our mud pit, and there's your cars he jumped over, and some obstacles along the way. One time, he got water in his engine. <coughs> <coughs> Logan sputtered, but Logan kept trying. Finally, he was able to get through the whole course in record time. Looks like he's having a good time there. I'm so proud of you, Dad said when Logan crossed the finish line. You are learning how to take things slow at first and then build up your skills. 
You can see how proud Dad is, he's smiling. When I become a great monster truck racer, I will have you to thank Dad, Logan said with a smile. Come on, let's do some donuts. The two laughed and roared their engines and enjoyed themselves as they made circles in the dirt. I hope you enjoyed that story, Logan. This is the story of Logan the monster truck. I hope you enjoyed this story brought to you by Grandma. And Pop. <laughs> Love you, Logan. Love you, Logan. See you soon. See you soon. Woohoo!